Uh, Boise, uh, reflect on last Saturday. It was uh, the perfect start, really, wasn't it? Yeah, great start. Um, great three points. Um, obviously, we know they're a good team um, from how they performed last season. Um, there was obviously unlucky not to get promoted in the end, but so we knew it was going to be a tough game. But we built obviously all pre season towards it, and um, yeah, they've come good. Good result, good um, three goals, three points. And clean sheet as well for the defence, which is a great start as well, isn't it? That's it, yeah. Obviously, we want to build ourselves on clean sheets. We've got quite a few last year, and obviously, we're going to try and beat that this year. For you as a, a defender, I suppose you'd be working really hard to, to get that starting shirt. You've got a lot of quality alongside you. Yeah, definitely. Um, just some good players at the club, some of the good defenders. Um, obviously, the ones from last year and the ones that have came in. It's competition for places. Um, we can. We're, we're all. We're all part of it. Um, I'm sure, there's going to be times where it gets chopped and changed, and that's just uh, the part, point of having a squad in football. Obviously, last season started with with a victory as well, but I suppose this one was a lot more convincing, a lot more. We looked a lot fitter, didn't we, and things like that in the, in the game. Yeah, it was a good performance on the on the whole. Obviously, we played Tamworth the first game of last season. It was it was scrappy. Um, just, still only get three points. Um, so yeah, that's all we can take from the game now. It's obviously we're moving forward. Next two games are all against, uh, both against teams that have been promoted. I suppose speaking about Tamworth, can't underestimate them, can we? Definitely not, no. Um, probably the, it's probably going to be a different type of game. Um, we're at home, obviously, this time. and Yeah, they just came up, but yeah, like I said, Tamworth were obviously brilliant last year and it, it can be done. Um, we know it's going to be a tough game. I've just said it loads of times, there's no easy games in football. You've got to, you can make it easy by playing well and doing your jobs. Yeah, obviously, teams that came here last season, that a lot of them sat in, a lot of them made it really frustrating for the crowd, for, for players. I suppose it's about trying to combat that again this season, isn't it? Yeah, definitely. Um, it's always we. It's, it's up to us as players on the pitch. Obviously, the staff, the management, to uh, muster up ways to break break teams down. If they sit in, they obviously want to catch on the counter attack. So we've got to be mindful of that. So yeah, it's obviously it's, it's what you what you train for all week and what you expect to come up against. Obviously, playing a different shape this season as well. How are you finding that? Yeah, enjoying it. Yeah, um, I think, I think it's um, we look good in pre-season. Um, we seem to have be grasping it well. Obviously, we're still we're still working towards things in training, but it was nice to see. Um, we have looked, did some clips today. What we've been working on in training and defensively attacking as well, and it's been coming off in in the in the first game. So yeah, um, like we we like the shape, and obviously we're gonna obviously use it to our advantage. Yeah. You've been in the centre of the three. Is that what you prefer, or how does it work for you? Yeah, I think that suits me. My um, my attributes in the middle. Um, yeah, um, if out of all the positions, I'd I'd rather be in the middle. Yeah. yeah. Obviously, you got yourself a goal uh, last weekend as well. Uh, nice folly as well, wasn't it? Peeling the way. Yeah, quite nice, didn't it? Yeah, <laughs> yeah. Um, obviously, I'm buzzing to score. Um, just to top the game off, really. I mean, I'm sure we'd have. Got the three points at two 0 but it was nice to just put that bit of icing on the cake. And obviously, as a centre half, it's great to get clean sheets. Also, nice to score. Yeah. I was going to say, I know we say it every single year, it's a bit of a, a cliche, but you really need to chip in, don't you, as, as defenders to to contribute to the, the attacking side as well as defensive. Yeah, the, the amount of dead balls we get, corners we, um, we get, it's an opportunity for anyone to score. Really, um, I, I me mean, personally, I were disappointed. I only got one goal last season. Um, I've got one now. I want to. I want to try and chip in a bit more. Yeah. And so you. I know it didn't happen last year, but you got a habit of scoring on opening days, haven't you? I think you yeah, the, yeah. the oval one as well. So. Yeah, yeah. Let's, let's not talk about last season. <laughs> yeah. Well, obviously, it was a great, a great day on, on, yeah, the, on the day. Was, yeah, it was a great day. Um, I suppose for you guys, as you know, three at the back, uh, four at the back, whatever it is, you get forward at any opportunity. I suppose that that extra man. As you go attacking, leave it wing backs, whatever, you've got that opportunity to go as well, haven't you? That's it, yeah. I mean, you, people might look at it as a five at the back. It's not. It's, you rotate, you know what I mean? You, your players go up, you just one pulls around. It's, for some people, it might look defensive, but it's actually, you might get another striker on the play with two strikers and you get wing backs higher up the pitch. It works, it works in both aspects. So, um, yeah, we're, we're enjoying it. I was going to say it must must have been a bounce in training this week as well after last weekend because 
I think everyone looked at the first fixture going into it thinking, well, it can't really get tougher than that. But then to come away with such an emphatic win, it must must be bouncing out there. Yeah, 100%. Um, been in high spirits. Obviously, it's a good confidence booster, morale booster. Like I said, beating a team like Brackley, we know they're going to be up there as, um, as well, hopefully. So, yeah, it was just a, you, you come in with a spring in your step. and But that's gone now. Like Monday, Tuesday, it's brilliant. Thursday, Friday, you, you're switching on to the next games. Back at home, looking forward to being back out there. Obviously, created such an unbelievable atmosphere last season. Yeah, definitely, definitely. Um, I'm sure there'll be a, f- a, f- a few in the um, few in the gate. Um, first home game of the season, it's uh, going to be bouncing. Yeah, and obviously, I suppose uh, speaking to Andy, the, the word is not to get complacent. Uh, that obviously, you wouldn't after one game, but it's important to reinforce that message, isn't it? No, yeah, of course. Um, obviously, it's easy to build up an all pre-season and get yourself up for a game like Brackley away who knows obviously it's going to be a tough game and then to not stay switched and focused on for the next game um, obviously if we let ourselves down on Saturday then it takes the gloss off last Saturday so hopefully we'll, we'll get another three points and I'm asking every every player as we speak to them as we go through to reflect on pre-season and just how tough it was for you guys to drag each other through as a team so yeah, from yeah. your perspective how was it? It was very tough, yeah. Um, especially the first couple of weeks, you just there's lads that are they're all different levels of fitness. Um, yeah, the first week was tough. We're in the woods. We're doing high drops, runs wherever they are. Um, it, it were hard, and we we did have to we had to pull people through. Um, it's not my strongest point, I admit. Um, long distance running, but you know, you, it's got one rule: like don't stop. Um, it, However, our advocates just don't stop. You slow down as much as you want, but don't, don't stop. So, yeah, um, we all found it hard. It's been hard, but we all hopefully can show the results of that going into the season, which yeah. I think we did on Saturday. I was going to say the last 10, 15 minutes, in particular, we just looked another gear ahead of the opposition. No disrespect to them, but it just it seemed like it paid off already. Yeah, that's it. And we've got advantages. We know we're full time. We know there's a lot of part time teams. You can put five subs on the pitch. That's going to be a Probably that's going to help us as well. We've got because we've got a strong bench and we've got a str- strong few players in the stands as well. So we want to use all them advantages to our advantage. So yeah, let's go.